Okay, we're going to plant some stuff here today. This is kind of like life, right? You plant a seed, and uh, you don't necessarily know what it's going to do. It takes faith, right? But you put it in, you put a little work behind it, and hopefully you get to where you're going, what you want out of it. So that's what we're doing here. Now, everybody has their own way of doing things. That's okay. Do it your own way. If you've got a certain way, you do it. Nothing wrong with that. You do it your way. Um, we do things a certain way here. But the idea is that you do. And the reason we do it this way is to show people that you don't need a lot of things. You don't need big rototillers. and You don't need all those things. All you need is determination, some willpower, and you'd be surprised what you'll do. That's what's wrong with the world today. Everybody says, well, I need this and I need that. No, you just need to get in it and do it. But read your Bible. That's one of the things the world today doesn't seem to seem to have any, any interest in is reading their Bibles. And uh, that's how you get tossed to and fro because you'll be reading some scripture. Maybe you didn't read another part of that. You didn't know it said that. So somebody comes along with that and they're like, well, this says this. And you're like, oh, goodness, I didn't realize. That's not good. You don't want that. Now I'm going to put some squash into my corn. Eats their own. But if you read your Bible, then you know. And it takes time anyway to read it, so. You can do this, folks. Pick up your Bible, read it. Figure out what God had to say to you, because it does say it in the Bible, what he wants from you. Don't be tossed to and fro. And remember, just a little patch of dirt, if you keep it tended and you put some seeds in. That's a blessing. That's a blessing. Now with these, these we put these in. These I grew these this year because of this reason. They're golden banded. These are hybrids, though, the ones I did this year. But you get quite a few uh, corn ears off them. But, uh, yeah, read your Bible, please, folks. Read them. Uh, come along and watch the videos. If, if that'll help you, maybe that'll help you. I don't mind reading to you. That's why we put the videos on. That's why we do it so people can't read so well or what the case may be. Go down through my old videos and you'll see all the... I do a lot of Bible. I like to make sure people get the Bible. But then you don't have to say, well, I didn't know it didn't say that, or I knew it did say that. You want to be able to read a couple times, you know. You want to be able to study and, and, and study to show yourself approved. I mean, everything I'm telling you is in the Bible. So get in there and get to know what the Lord has to say to you. God bless.